PHP 8.1 added a bunch of new features, but enumerations are by far our favorite new feature. In this video, we'll explain why. Hello developers and welcome to PHP Developers TV, your home for everything you need to know to be a knowledgeable PHP developer. I'm your host, as always, Scott Keck Warren. In this video, we're going to be talking about enumerations in PHP 8.1. Enumerations are a new feature in the 8.1 release of PHP. Enumerations, or enums for short, allow us to define a new structure, much like a class, but that can only hold a set of allowed values. In the past, this was handled by using public constants in a class. When we needed to set a variable to one of these states, we'd do the following. The problem with this method is that because we're just setting the variable to a value, we could, and most likely did, do something like the following. Now this is a valid expression, but causes us to have an invalid value of 4 in the value variable. Using enums will define our values like the following, and we can still set our values like so. But now it's impossible for us to set it to an invalid case. It also has the added bonus of allowing us to pass these as parameters to a function, so we're always sending valid data into that function. Enum to scalar. So the slight downside to enumerations over plain integers is that by default they have no scalar equivalent. This makes it a challenge for us to save these values to a database or a data store. Thankfully we can define what the scalar equivalent is for each value. We might get these from our database or come up with them on our own. This is called a backed enum because it's backed up by a value. We can also use string values instead of integer values. When we're using backed enums, we must create a unique scalar equivalent for all values. If we duplicate a value, we'll get an error, and if we skip a value, we'll also get an error. Now that we've defined our scalar equivalents, we can grab it by using the value property, scalar to enum. When we need to get from our scalar value back to an enum value, we can use the from method on the enum. This method takes the string or integer value and converts it back to an enum. If a value is passed that doesn't match the allowed values, there will be an error. In order to make this safe, PHP 8.1 gives us the tryFrom function that will return null instead of throwing an error. Methods and interfaces. Enums may contain methods and are also able to implement interfaces. Helper functions. An undocumented benefit of enums is the ability to create a class that can't be initialized, which makes it a good spot to put helper functions. What you need to know. Enums are being added in PHP 8.1. They provide the ability to have a specific set of values, and this gives us better data integrity. As always, thank you for watching our video. Please make sure you subscribe, comment, and like, as it does help others find us. This is Scott Keck Warren for PHP Developers TV signing off, and reminding you to keep coding.